What is going on guys, Roadmaster, and today we're doing a top speed build on a 1967 Sunbeam Tiger. I've seen this car on a uh, TV once, yeah, I think it was Counting Cars. So, I don't know if you guys seen that show, but uh, yeah, they make custom cars and uh, th this was on it. They, I don't think I ended, ended up buying it though, so uh, yeah, let's take this thing to the track and see what it can do. Alright guys, we're back, and uh, let's see how this thing sounds. Meet the mic. Doesn't sound bad, it's got some nice rumble to it. I don't know what kind of engine's in here, but I'm assuming it's a V8, maybe, maybe not. I forgot what kind of car this was based off of. But uh, if you guys know, put it down in the comments. So uh, yeah, I think this thing can hit 130. Or so, so uh, let's get an interior view, and in three, two, one, go. A right, good start. Kept the uh, RPMs high. All right, there's 80, 90, 95, 100, fourth gear, 110, 115. 118, 19, 120, alright, let's get to 10 more miles per hour, 5 more, 126, 127, oh, we're definitely going to get over 130, there is 130, 131, 132, this doesn't have, this only has 4 gears, 134, 135, 136, come on, get to 140, oh, come on, little sunbeam, 137 come on I know you can get there alright maybe I don't know I will keep going until after we get to the turn there's 138 we'll, we'll break after we get to the turn we need to stay on the pavement though come on no we're going back down uh, yeah, we're not going to get 140 and here's a turn and brake. I almost put it in reverse there. I right, 138, not bad. Eight miles an hour over what I thought I was gonna get. So uh, I'll see you guys when we get back to the upgrade shop. All right, guys, we are back. And let's see what we can get this car up to. It says A class, but I'm assuming S class, because we can always go class over if we do conversions. Uh, engine swaps. Let's see. We have an inline six turbo or inline four turbo rally, which is like in every car. We have the V8, which is in like every car, and we got the V6. I think I'm gonna stick with the stock. As much as those powers, those other engines would give us, I'm gonna stick with stock and throw some turbos on it. Drive train. I'm gonna keep it rear wheel drive. So let's upgrade this engine and um. If you guys don't know, American Truck Simulator comes out on February 3rd, which is Wednesday. So uh, let me know if you guys, or no, no, wait, scratch, scratch that. Leave me some questions down below, because I'm going to do a QA. and a I'm going to take a nice little drive on that game and uh, drive across California and uh, I'll do some Q&As. Because I feel like that'd be easier than just showing you guys Forza gameplay. Because I want to switch, I want to switch up my content a little bit. So maybe uh, every time I do, it, or if you guys want me to do, I can do a um, a career. A uh, no, what's it called? A let's play. I can do a let's play on Euro Truck Simulator. I mean, no, not Euro Truck. Um, dang, American Truck. Euro Truck Simulator is already out. But yeah, I can do a, a career. Uh, yeah, I keep calling it career mode. A let's play on your truck. I'm just gonna stop talking about the game. Put your comments or questions down below. Hashtag Ask Roadmaster. So yeah, I'm just gonna stop talking about it. I keep calling it Euro Truck. It's American Truck. 
All right, uh, let's see. We have 580 horsepower. That's I thought I, I was hoping we'd get up to 600 with the stock engine, but that's not too bad. It's only 20 away. We're good. All right, brakes. We do race brakes and uh, springs. Let's lower this thing all the way. Ooh, it looks good. Look at that back wheel arch. Lines up. That wheel gap is just perfect. We already have that. Why am I trying to do it again? I right, anti roll bar so we don't roll over, but we probably will because we're so light with so much power. Just like the uh, Holden Tirana X9. I I can't remember what else. I think I think there's another letter. Maybe not. Maybe maybe it's just the XI X X9. God, I'm derping up so bad in this, in this video. All right, let's go clutch and get this transmission race transmission. There we go. Uh, drive line, race drive line, subtracts 13 pounds, and race differential just because. Why don't I have a race differential? And uh, lastly, wheels and tires. This thing probably has like. Hmm. This thing probably has like 225s on both front and back. Wait. 175s. Oh yeah, because 225s are way too... Oh yeah, we can't put 225s on it. Look at that. I told you we get to S-Class. No 245s on my back. Okay, it's got some nice grip. I'm going to keep the wheels the same. Tune car. And uh, yeah, we will be done then. If you guys want to download this tune, uh, look at my gamer tag, Shader Means 7 in the description down below. Or it will be in the description down below, so you guys can spell it. Just uh, put that in the Forza, and it should come up with all my tunes. Yeah. Uh, let's see if we can get more than 204. Nope, doesn't look like it, so we're going to keep it like that. Don't need any camber. Make this a little bit softer. Softer. Uh, make this stiffer. Make this stiffer. And, uh, yeah. I actually, I'm gonna raise it back up for the thumbnail. I like the wheel gap that it has right now. And just put all this for stiffer. And, uh, yeah. Alright, so I will see you guys when we get back to Le Mans. Alright, guys, we are back. And, uh,. Let's see how this thing sounds now, fully upgraded. Sounds a lot better. So, um... Yeah, top speed, I think we'll hit 204. Because that's what it said, and we had enough straight. So let's go in three, two, one, go. All right, come on, it's spinning in first. Bounce it off the rev limiter for the first two gears. Right, there's 130, 140, 150, 160. Oh, it's a nice drifter. I might turn this into my drift car. All right, there's 185. 190, 193, 194, 195, 196, 6th gear, 197, 198, 199, 200, okay, then we go 201, come on, go 202, go, I really like this green color of this car, I'm glad I picked it, 203, Come on, one more, one more. Let's go. No, don't go down. Oh, yeah, this is where we lose it. Oh, did you guys see that drift? That was nice. That was so nice, but we got to 203. One mile per hour short. And break. Yes. So, two... Let's see, what did we get? 204. No, we got, we got the 203. So, uh, 
yeah, if you got, oh my god, all these invites, I'm sorry guys, forgot to turn my notifications off. But, if you guys enjoyed, enjoyed this video, leave a like down below, comment what you guys want us next, don't forget to subscribe for more content, and I will see you guys at the next one. See you on the track.